one of my most popular videos of all time on YouTube was the 8 capacitor washer launcher. Well, we're back at it again. This time it's got 10 capacitors. I replaced that smoking resistor with a 50 watt resistor instead of 5. Uh, basically with uh, 10 capacitors it's ranged as two banks of 5 each capable of 2 kilovolts. They are 4,000 microfarads, so if you put a, uh, let me see, should be half of that, I can't figure, it's between about 1,500 microfarads at 2,000 volts total, meter on the front end. Of course, what that does, it comes out to my flat coil, on which we place a five and a quarter inch hard drive platter. And this time, instead of just doing one soda can, we're going to crunch three soda cans. The goal is to destroy all three soda cans or flatten them. We're setting that on top of uh, something I just happen to have. Uh, insulation uh, for around the heat pipes. That's holding up our cinder block. And hopefully the cinder block won't fall down because some people claim the cans are crushed by the cinder block falling down, but that is not the case. So anyways, let me get this all set up and we'll see what it looks like. Okay, there we are, ready to uh, do a test firing. First we're going to fire up the power supply, hope it doesn't blow. Fifty watt resistor has smoke coming off of it. That's at one thousand microfar or one thousand volts so far, smoking away. One thousand volts. Fifteen hundred. Capacitors aren't hot. I think I'm going to get a stick to hit the fire button with. So I'm not in that close like a fire. We didn't successfully flatten them. We did bend them up a bit. There's a third one. That was uh, 2,000 volts at 1,600 amps. Thank you. Okay, for our next experiment, we're going to do a freeform launch how many seconds in the air it spends, we know how much power we got. So here we're charging back up. 50 watt resistor is not smoking. It usually just does that the first time you fire the capacitors. One and a half thousand volts. Okay, we're at 2,000 volts. Study doesn't go past 2,000 volts. Ready for free launch? Okay, we're back at the 2,000 volt washer launcher. This 
time we have a single soda can and bricks on the side. We're going to once attempt, again attempt to flatten the soda can, and hopefully without the thing falling over so you can see that the soda can is crushed not by the center block but by the electromagnetic force. We're currently at one and a half kV. Not getting any smoke off the resistor for a change. Coming up on 2 kV. Seems to stall at right about 1.8 kV. Never quite make it all the way there, so let's 